to a friend at Rilke's grave in Rerum. Alles ist eins, Rilke. The black-faced sheep are bleeding, their bells a soft song, a clinking of spoons in tin cups, a call to presence when the world draws them into its map of the living. The pine trees know how the dark hum of a new season enters the lungs like a promise. And if it is a promise, how can it be sustained? I stand in bare feet near my rucksack and the gray slate path to his grave. The mountains offer distance, the snow a memory of a life I barely recall, just the blue repeating of the Alps and from somewhere a chant, three words that fall from the air as my shadow touches his grave. And as I whisper them over and over, I cannot say he isn't present or that the dead don't move toward what calls them. Only how the valley stretches its worn jacket on the grass and begs me to stay. How my heart is a spinnaker in the wind, catching the breath of it. I linger as long as I can until the shadow of his cross escapes into darkness and make my way back through the mosaic of gravestones and the plots of bright flowers planted near each grave. Cross the corner where the aspen trembles and then I see you just as you are awoken from the place of dreams, and I cannot tell where the soft green slope of the hill ends and your hip begins. I want to say, don't forget her. She's still on the hill, her body shaded from October sun, her face in profile, arms resting on knees as she looks into the deepening veil. Aren't parts of us buried in the lands we meet? Our souls broken into bones, sure as flint. There are foxes like wood smoke in the body. They move quickly in the forest. They know one of their own. They will find you. They will dig you up.